Bueno, chuchets, aquí estamos con el capítulo 2 de Call of Cthulhu, ¿no? Ya habíamos empezado la investigación en, el, en nuestra office, oficina, por así decirlo, y nos ha traído aquí al puerto de Dark Water, así que vamos a ello. Capítulo 2, puerto de Dark Water. Pierce toma el caso Hawkins. La artista maldita ha sido acusada de provocar el incendio que mató a su familia, incluida ella. La única pista es una perturba perturbadora pintura que le dejó a su padre. En la etiqueta de envío figura la dirección de un almacén situado en la isla de Darkwater. Es verdad, tenemos que buscarlo. Ese lugar parece ser el punto de partida de la investigación de Pierce. Entrémonos en la locura. Ah, vale, parece que empieza ahora. Esto así como muy verde, ¿verdad? Muy cuzul. Vamos ya. Y que ha dado muy cinematográfico. Estila. Estila se llamaba una de Resident Evil 5, creo recordar, ¿no? O algo así. Stay on board. There's guys coming to unload. Ah, mira qué suerte he tenido. Welcome to Darkwater Island, Mr. Pierce. Why, thank you, Captain Fitzroy. So, what wind brought you? Harper Island. Does the Hawkins case mean anything to you? Ah, a sad story that we would all prefer to forget. Charles Hawkins may have been a landlubber, but he was a good man. And his wife, Sarah Hawkins. A ah, nice young woman, and a great pain to what a tragedy. You know what? Go have a drink at the Stranded Whale. What you need is a good pick-me-up. Mitchell may not be very welcoming, but his bar holds a surprise for you. As for me, you'll find me at the Harbor Master's office. If it's the Hawkins family that brings you here, I have a pile of documents that should interest you. Understood. I'm going for a look around the docks. Vale. Ahora con Fitzroy, que es este. Pero podíamos hacer más cosas. Bueno, los muelles de Dogwater. No ves que estaba en el cielo. Se ofreció ayudarme Fidro y el capitán. El único barco capaz de llegar hasta el continente. Es posible que tenga a ver los documentos. Vale, Fidro me ha aconsejado ir al bar del puerto. Tónico estimulante. Bueno, pues vamos a ir. Los pescadores se han reunido junto al cadáver de una horca. Sí, lo hemos visto. Te voy a echar un vistazo. Quizá la policía. El capitán Fidro se ha ofrecido a compartir conmigo descubrimientos. Vale. Eh, pa, 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 ir al bar, hablar con Bradley y hablar con Fidro. no sé quién es Bradley, pero bueno. Bradley Cooper será. Tenemos un punto disponible. Esperamos a tener más. Esperamos a tener más. <coughs> Lugares. Bueno, la isla de Darkwater. Vale. Y el puerto de Darkwater. Vale. Y el inventario.
Sanitario A ver, conocimiento Sí, el de medicina Que no lo pillamos, vale ¿Qué vamos primero, chicos? Vamos a ver lo de la ballena esta Lo de la orca, que parece que está aquí Ah, mira, es Bradley, es el Deje Hey, Sullivan Can't you go any faster? The same goes for you, sir. Move along. Continue. I'm looking for this address. Warehouse 36, Darkwater Harbor. Harper Island. Ah. And so who are you? I didn't introduce myself. Edward Pierce, private detective. In any case, it's not very important. I can't answer that. You can't, or you don't want to. Oh, no, no. I'm not getting into those games, me. Now, please, allow me to do my job. You can't understand. You're not sailors. It's a sign. There's something coming. I'm a Some... The blood is just beginning to coagulate. It died a short time ago. Only a specialist would know what killed him. That's no way to treat an omen. Oh, yeah. Un especialista de los con nosotros. Eh, vamos a ir al bar, yo creo. Vamos a hablar con este señor. Eh, no, caballero. Aquí podemos pasar. No nos dejan. Sí. Vale, necesitamos otra cosa. Vamos al bar entonces. Open. Aquí hay algo. Prohibition is just a joke around here. That suits me fine. Teníamos uno de esos en el otro sitio, ¿os acordáis? Que dije que era como el juego. Adiós. But you can stay to watch if you want. There's nothing for you here either. Beat it. Vale. Por aquí no puedo pasar. Hola, señor. Vamos a salvar, anda. Por aquí parece que no hay mucho y luego como tendremos que salir. Tonterías van a ir aquí a Pierce. Uy. Let's get him another drink. He's dry. In my bar, we don't serve troublemakers. You saw what happened. He's the troublemaker. Oh, you're a true mainlander, a real princess. You strut around with your la-di-da ways, and then, as soon as the pressure arises, you start squealing. You don't have what it takes to drink my whiskey. You've got to earn it. I'm here for information, not for a fight. I prefer it that way. Speak, then. I reserve the right to answer or not. Do you know where this place is? Warehouse 36, Darkwater Harbor. The Hawkins Warehouse. I see, yeah. If I were you, I wouldn't hang around there. Why not? First off, there are rumors. Sailors from around here say you can hear noises coming from the warehouse at night. Screams, that sort of thing. Screams? And that's not all. There's the fate of its owners and all the superstitions that go with it. But I'll say no more. Anything else? The Stranded Whale. I guess this bar has been here a long time. What can I tell you? I'm a nostalgic sort of guy. 
The name, it reminds us of the golden age of dock water, when our whalers left for long months and came back, sweating and stinking of the oil and flesh of the whales they'd been hunting. It was a tough time, all the same. Ah, but steeped in glory. We've never known such wealth since then. What can you tell me about her? We all knew she was famous on the mainland for her paintings. Never understood why. Then, I don't want to speak ill of the dead. Money. Her vision, was it so terrible? The way I see it, the truth is really a question of point of view. Well, you mean, do you still trust the truth after a bottle of whiskey? I've got what I need. Anything else? Captain Fitzroy told me about a little pick-me-up. Oh, yeah? That must have been before you came looking for a fight in my bar. Oh, come on. Because of a little tussle. Drinking it here is a privilege, and I grant the privilege to whoever I want. Anything else? That'll be all for now. Vale, estas cosas en teoría repercutirán con lo que hacemos. A ver. Do you like our song? No. <laughs> We're true sirens. We may not be pros, but we give it all we've got. That's true. It's a reminder of the time when we were still fishing for whales off Darkwater Island. I've never heard this song before. Only people from here know it. It tells the story of the miraculous catch. It's a local legend? Watch what you say, young man. That catch saved our <laughs> island. Ah. Where's the proof? We're the proof. Without it, the whole of Darkwater would have died of hunger in 1847. It's true. Everything happened, just as it says in the newspaper report. What report? The one that's framed right behind you. Our grandparents tasted its flesh. And it oh. was delicious. Oof. What brought whaling to an end? The whales, of course. They all disappeared. You exhausted the stocks. You could say that, yes. There were fewer and fewer of them. Until the last, the biggest. One of the miraculous catch. Exactly. I bid you farewell, gentlemen. Good night, stranger. So long. Hmm. Nightmares. Can hear things and voices whispering. Will follow its reader and appear at various locations, gifted with its own consciousness, until it finds a new reader. The miraculous catch. Apparently, the most significant event of the last 80 years. La Saloma. 21 de mayo de 1847. Pesca milagrosa. El Estila. Regresa a puerto para salvar Darkwater del hambre. Habíamos perdido la esperanza. La tripulación del Estila, o lo que queda de ella, retornó al puerto de Darkwater la tarde del martes. Los lugareños acudieron a la carrera a los muelles para dar la bienvenida al último ballenero de la isla y quedaron estupefactos al contemplar la asombrosa captura que la valiente embarcación traía a, borde, a bordo. El cetáceo, superior en tamaño incluso a las formidables ballenas dentadas, llenaba toda la cubierta hasta el punto de rebosar en parte por las bordas. Lo que explica perfectamente el apelativo del que ya se le conoce, la pesca milagrosa. Vale, es el barco en el que hemos venido, ¿eh? Los supervivientes relataron una aterradora historia sobre su peligrosa travesía, pero también cantaron las excelencias de la carne de la criatura, inigualable por su calidad y sus innumerables beneficios en materia de nutrición. Es indudable que el extraordinario tamaño de la bañera permitiría alimentar a muchos de los habitantes de Darkwater y pondrá fin a la, isla, a la hambruna que padecía la isla, vale. Hay dos noticias más. Almacén el alquiler. Señor Marx pone Marx 
pone su almacén, eh, su almacén en alquiler a partir de junio para actividades pesqueras. Vale. Verá especial a la bañera varada. Todo el personal de la ballena varada les invito a una degustación excepcional. Y totalmente gratuita. Vale. A ver qué es eso del cubo. Leños, tenemos al de la. Vale. Lugares, pues la cantina está la ballena esta. Sobre la water. Vale. Esto no podemos hablar. Yo supongo que sí. Hay una señorita ahí al fondo. No hay más por aquí, vamos a mirar primero. Cerrada. Esperar era. What you looking at, stranger? The clientele is predominantly male. Tell me something I don't know. I meant nothing by it. I'm just wondering what a woman like you is doing in this flea trap. And I'm wondering what could be going through the head of the chump who goes to disturb her. Let me drink, stranger. Huh? I told you to beat it. Vale. Hemos empezado con buen pie con esta señora. Vamos a hablar con Fitzroy. Vamos al primero. You again? Sí, yo. Nah, no nos va a decir nada. That'll be all for now. Pues vámonos. Vamos a ver si hay algo por aquí, así que ver. Charles Hawkins was a heavy drinker and a debtor. <laughs> La gente que debe. Interesting. Si eso lo he visto antes, ¿esto tiene algo que decir? Miembros del, del personal del manicomio. Uh. Son los que estaban allí de aquellos, yo creo. El faro, qué bonito. Pues hablemos con él. Un momento. Aquí hay un señor, ¿no? Pescando. No sé si tiene algo que decir. Pues no. Y al otro lado no podemos pasar. Así que hablemos con el Fitzroy este. Vamos a hablar con él. No le importará que eche un ojo, ¿no? I wonder what Captain Fitzroy has got to say about this woman cat. Los términos de nuestro acuerdo están bien claros. Mantener a sus hombres bajo control. Provocarnos es un lujo que no puede usted permitirse. No hace falta que responda a este mensaje. <ríe> Limítese a pagar a su portador, Gat. Fantástico. Voy a cerrar para que... Broken. This place seems half abandoned. Sí, pero aquí está este hombre. Madre mía, qué sitio más lúgubre, me encanta. Vamos a ver. Tenemos por aquí antes de hablar con este señor, vamos a ver. The Scylla. It finished up beached at the entrance to the harbor. A souvenir from a more prosperous era. I guess this blackboard hasn't been wiped for more than 70 years. Fishing equipment. <laughs> Could do with some rust remover. Ah, poquito bater. Caso es que el tío, yo estoy por aquí a mis anchas, aquí campando a mis anchas, y el tío no me dice nada. Está también todo un, un poquito polvo, ¿no? Nada, yo sigo, ¿eh? Mira, medicina. Este segundo volumen es una guía sobre ética y buenas prácticas para el personal médico. Vale, pues hemos subido. Medicina, fenomenal. Aquí subiendo niveles. Ahora hablaremos con él, no tan rápido. This man and Fitzroy could be twins. Sí, es el Fitzroy este, sí. 
Bueno, o su padre, o, o él Aquí no hay nada What a macabre, souvenir. Ah, no, es una pata de... Pensaba que era un remo pequeño, madre mía eh, Poco más, creo que vamos a hablar con Fitzroy Que tiene nombre de, de nazi, eh, así un poco... Vamos a ver qué se cuenta Vamos delante, anda, vamos a hacerlo bien I brought out the Charles Hawkins cargo manifests. They're on the table next to you. But in truth, you're likely to be disappointed. When you're done, come join me on the deck. Okay. ¿Qué me ha dicho? Ah, vale, esto. These manifests are signed by Charles Hawkins. That's all I'll get from them. Son las pocas fechas son legibles aún. Aquí, 1890, 1907 y una última media borrada. El resto del documento está tachado. ¿Quién tendría interés en ocultar esta información? ¡Cuzulu! Coño, ¿qué pasa? Vaya, todo le ha cogido. Ah, vale. Bueno, en teoría esto se supone, yo creo que he hecho antes de lo que tenía que hacer, que es mirar todo. Me voy a remirar por si acaso, por ejemplo, no he venido aquí. Ah, claro, porque no hay nada. Vale. No hay mucho más. Ya ve que chulo. From here I see everything that goes on in the harbor. The hard working lives of my sailors, the fights of the stranded whale. <laughs> Even the antics of these war friends don't escape me. It's you who lays down the law around here. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I'm just the last serving captain on dark water. Tell me what I can do to help you. Espera un segundo. Bueno, antes de nada. Vale, los documentos son Your manifests have been blacked out. They're totally unreadable. Bueno, ya me lo había dicho. Yeah, I saw that. I've got no idea who did it. Or why? I don't remember having countersigned anything special enough for someone to hide it. And why obliterate the dates, as well as the goods stored in the warehouse? You mean that the dates have some meaning? I'm surprised Charles Hawkins had goods to store, knowing that whaling stopped in 1847. <laughs> I see that you are interested in the history of our island. Indeed, maritime activities ceased altogether at the end of the last century. I imagine that the Hawkins family had other types of contracts. But you don't know with whom? No, it was none of my business. I'm looking for Warehouse 36. Do you know where it is? Look, it's right there. The warehouse is opposite the jetty. You can't miss it. Vale. Understood. You know who the building belongs to, don't you? It belonged to the Hawkins family. Precisely. Ship owners from father to son. Mm -hmm. I think that somebody here wanted me to search this warehouse. Hombre. Vale. Donde decía que estaba hablando de dar water un poquito. Hostias. Ah, la foto. ¿Quién es Kat? Kat va a ser la de... I found a threatening letter. Signed by a certain cat. What? I don't mind you visiting my harbor master's office, but I'd prefer if you didn't go through my affairs. Are you being blackmailed? Not exactly, no. That shyster wants to make us pay protection money. With any success? I wouldn't say that. But she terrifies my men as much as her own. Can you not do anything to stop her? Don't you worry about that. Vale. I was looking at your photograph, the one of the man in front of the boat. Ah, yes, I can see the one you're talking about. Interesting resemblance. I thought it was you, but with a wooden leg. And for good reason. That's my father in the photograph. Your father? John Fitzroy, captain of the Scylla. His wooden leg is here. You can go and hey, see it if you're interested. <laughs> I'm just back from the wharves. 
A dead killer whale is unsettling the sailors. Ah, yes. Us men of the sea are superstitious folk. Killer whales don't have many known predators. That's true. And normally, they're not found around here. But, um, <laughs> you're gonna take me for a fool. No, no. Give it a try. Have you heard about the depths? Trenches that plunge into the earth and that shelter creatures unlike any other. You're talking about mythology. <laughs> Indeed, you're right. <laughs> the police took the decision to put the killer whale back into the sea. You've got to understand them. They didn't know what to do with it. I think that was a mistake. Who says that whatever caused those wounds is no longer in these waters? <laughs> you think we should have kept it? To look into the real cause of its death, at least. The miraculous catch. Is it a local legend? Not at all. It's an episode from our glorious past. Go read the story of the sailors' return to Darkwater Harbor. It's displayed on a wall of the stranded sí. whale. I shall be on my way. So come back and see me when you've got something new. Okay. Hemos ganado un puntito de. Así que vamos a ver. Hay que entrar al almacén, vale. Eh, Pierce. ¿Qué los gastamos? Chuchets. Aquí no podemos. Es que fuerza. Psicología. 4, 4, 6. Claro, 6, 4. Creo que esto nos va a hacer falta. ¿No? Sí, validamos. Vale. Eh... Dark Water. Sí, está el. Este nuevo, el Fitzroy. Pistas. Tenemos varias ya. Esto. Lo de Cat, que va a ser esa, el patapalo. Y bueno, esto no nos sirve para mucho. Bueno, sí, hemos conseguido otra de estas. Vale. Vamos a entrar en el almacén. Porque mira, ya se han apartado estos dos. Una vez me ha dicho. ¿Te podré hablar con él o pasa de mí? You can't. You didn't tell me that the warehouse I was looking for was right in front of us. Because its owner is dead. And I don't want to see you hanging around it. Vale. Now please, leave us to our work. You That's can't no understand. You're not Hasta luego, cocodrilo. Oh, yeah. Pero, vamos a aprovechar y vamos a ver qué hay por aquí. Otro pescador, que no se lo puede decir nada. Una estatua allí. Hmm. Anda, pues lo he abierto. There. Fenomenal. Pues entre usted. ¿Qué hay aquí? Uh, no se ve una mierda. Se volverá que. Ahí, ahí. Ah, necesito luz. Vale. Hmm. Casa sabe que están robando licor. No tarda en averiguar quién es el responsable y cuando lo haga, no me gustaría estar el pellejo de ese infeliz. Y atrás, nada. Somebody's stealing from the bootlegger's stock of liquor. Hello, old friend. Se me va a venir guay. ¿Y cómo se quita el mechero este? Ah, claro, igual que en el vale. Hemos encontrado la pista que había ahí. Hay que entrar al almacén, que bueno, sabemos que es aquel. A ver que si aquí nos deja ver, coño, que hay ahí escrito. Está en Guzuliano. Y aquí se puede bajar para volver a subir por aquí. Fantástico. Vale. Me encanta esta vista así con el faro y está encallado. Aquello es el estila entonces. Y el que hemos venido también, ¿no? Le habrán puesto el mismo nombre. Nosotros vamos a seguir por aquí merodeando un pelín antes de entrar al... Pero ya está. No hay mucho más, por lo que veo, activado. Aquí hay un triste. No le puedo decir nada, vale. Vale, y... ¿Dónde está...? ¿Cómo podemos entrar? 
estos dos podemos hablar con ellos? You live here. Why did you do that, huh? We saw what you did to Saint Brandon. Yeah, we'll teach you to come onto our island and ridicule our protectors. I respect your beliefs. Our beliefs? You mean you don't believe in God? That's irrelevant. That's what you think. There's you, our beloved statue, and then those two bozos behind us. Wait, now that I think about it, it's got to be them. Claro. There's one of them who's always going back and forth to the statue. Quieter. That's all we need for them to hear us. What brings you to dark water? The two guys behind you. What are they El doing? Almacen. The bootleggers. Scum. They're protecting their territory. From whom, I wonder? They, mean. they really don't have a choice anyway. They're more scared of cat than an attack oh, by God. drunken sailors. If only they would kill each other. Quién es Cat? Is it Cat who's shaking down Captain Fitzroy? Oh, hold on, hold on, just a minute. We didn't tell you a thing. <laughs> Nothing at all. <laughs> that statue represents your local saint. What do you mean by local, exactly? You wouldn't be looking down at us, like all townspeople do. Saint Brendan. He protected whalers and fishermen like us. Until those assholes defaced him. Isn't that a bit early for alcohol? We got nothing better to do anyway. There's not much work around here. Fitzroy gives us a few chores every now and again, but since the whaling station shut down, ain't a lot of jobs left around here. So we drink. <laughs> Peculiar house. Yeah, that's where we live, our boat. It's not because it doesn't float anymore that we're going to abandon it. I've taken enough of your time. We'll see you later. Vale. No sé si hay algo aquí. No, if it gets out, I'll have serious problems with you know who. How could you be dumb enough to leave the entrance to the warehouses unguarded? Keep your voice down. Why not go and shout at the cat while you're at it? I don't want to end up with her little knife under my throat. It's a stiletto, you idiot. And with that smell on your breath, I don't give you much chance anyway. Okay, algo? No. A ver. Aquí es donde tengo que entrar, ¿no? Este señor. Where do you think you're going? I'm not here to hinder your work, officer. Edward Pierce, private detective. Sorry, we're all a little on edge today. What are you doing here? I'm investigating the death of the Hawkins family. Darn it. Why do you want to drag up all that stuff again? My investigation has led me to this warehouse. That case was closed months ago. Who are these others so interested in the warehouse? And why would I tell you? You and I are on the same side of the law. Oh, yeah? You don't want to know the truth behind this case. Are you saying our work was not up to snuff? Forget it. Thank you for your valuable help. Okay, sir. No idea. What's with you wandering around here like a hungry dog? We saw you talking to the two soaks. Go die of thirst, a lot of you. It'll stink less. I've got to enter the Hawkins warehouse. I guess it's going to be complicated. No, it's very simple, in fact. 
Fuck off. I don't give a damn about your racket. I just want to get into this warehouse. Now we don't give a damn about you. Whatever your reason for wanting inside, there's nothing we can do for you. What will Kat say when she finds out that it's you who are filching stock? You've got no proof. That's true. Apart from this little note from your friend here. You didn't throw it away? I couldn't know that someone was gonna force the lock. What a f So, what is it you want? Passar. To get into the Passar. Hawkins warehouse. That's all. Go on then. And we never want to see your rat snout again. Gracias, caballeros. Madre mía. Vamos a ver si hay por aquí algo. Antes de. Entrar al almacén. La verdad es que mola mucho el. ¿Aquí puedo subir? No. Vale. Let's see. Vamos, esta tengo que abrirla. Bien. Perfect. Oh, this place stinks. What is the connection between this place and the Sarah Hawkins case? Adios. Vamos a ver qué es esto de mantener la escena. Tenemos poderes. Who has enough money to buy painkillers, but stays in a place like this? Can't sleep. I know how that feels. It smells as bad as it looks. <laughs> Uf, el cuadro lo voy a dejar para el final. Someone treasures this crumpled picture to the point of sleeping with it. The glass is shattered, like someone smashed it. Was it before or after the removal of these bandages? A lo mejor es que no he sacado tirada suficiente para verlo. Creo que le toca el cuadro. Ocultismo que tengo nada y menos. Is this one of Sarah Hawkins' paintings? Vale. Hace un segundo. Vale. Tenemos la carta esta y el whisky. Y un puntele más. Que vamos a subir en. Aquí, ya que estamos aquí. Vale, ahora sí. Somos unos investigadores brutales. Y vamos a ver qué encontramos por aquí, ¿no? Que hay que salir. Porque no tengo objetivo, ¿no? Muelles de Dark Water. Vale, una banda contra la lista. Vale, ¿y ahora qué? ¿Qué pasa si intento irme? Oh, someone has settled in here. And whoever it is has something to tell me about the Hawkins case. Is there anyone in there? You! Don't move! Detective Pierce, I told you to stay away from this warehouse. No, 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 no. You seem like a competent officer. We should help each other. You're trying to manipulate me, Mr. Pierce. I hate to be Joder. taken for a fool. All right, Inspector Lestrade. Let me take a more direct approach. 
Can you explain what this painting is doing here? This strange poetry. Wait, I know it. It was in the Hawkins mansion when we came to investigate the fire. So you confirm that it was removed from the crime scene? Uh -huh. Interesting. I'd like to go and see the mansion now. Of course. You want to go back along his trail? Claro. <sighs> I'd like to understand how this painting o sea, made ah, it to vale, here. No Come on. My car is parked down the way. Andrews, would you please shut the door? Adiós, Andrews. Open your eyes, damn it. This guy went right under your nose. Bueno, no exactamente, eh? God damn it. Her again. Oh, cat. This case has nothing to do with you, Baker. Clear the passage Baker, or I'll shut you up for obstruction. Officer Bradley, you've finally grown a pair. Too bad you're too fat to see them down there. Why you? Come on, keep the smile. You don't want to force me to widen it. Okay, I get it. Can we go to the mansion now? Who the hell are you? What were you doing on my turf? I've got my eye on you. We'll meet again. Is it far, this mansion? Look behind you, at the top of the ridge. You see the building? Oh, guapísima. That's the Hawkins mansion. Come on, I got some driving to do. Estás tardando. Vale, pues la mansión del Hawkins, el jardín por lo que veo, va a ser el próximo capítulo. De momento muy bien, o sea, lo de los muelles está interesante. ¿Quién habrá llevado ahí el cuadro? ¡Cuzulu! Todo lo hace Cuzulu, por Dios. Y nada, vamos a una mansión, con lo que me gustan a mí. Pero eso será en el, en el próximo, ¿vale? El próximo capítulito. Chuchets, espero que os esté gustando, ¿vale? Pues venga, hasta otra.